the word on the fans, they were fantastic throughout the whole night. Yeah, they didn't sing my name though, did they? <laughs> <laughs> right, how are you? Okay, fire away. You okay? Hey. Hi, John. Um, you must have felt as if you were going to get back in the game first. Yeah, I thought we started the game really well. Um, we came with a plan. Um, I thought the lads were really playing some really good stuff. And um, yeah, we were in the game, weren't we? And then, unfortunately, we made a mistake which wasn't in the plan. <laughs> and it was a piece of individual brilliance, one that maybe could have been avoided, but it was a wonderful finish by past a top class goalkeeper. Um, but the lads then showed some character that we'd asked for in terms of staying in the game and still playing, creating chances. And as any coach will tell you, um, when you come to the big boys, you really have to, you have to take your chances when you get them. And I think we created three or four. You might, you might tell me differently, guys. But, um, but listen, we didn't take them. And then we should have won a ball in our half. Didn't win a 50-50. And again, another piece of brilliance. What a goal! Um, my thought then was, Christ, we've got to stay in this game. You know, I was really fearful because we had a number of players playing who hadn't played for a while. For instance, Moritz Bauer, who was outstanding. Um, he hadn't played since the 30th, 13th of December. Um, Bruno Martins in. He hadn't played since the 2nd of December. Stephen Ireland only his second game back, so obviously I was fearful of that. So we tried to shore it up, and then the hair makes an absolutely world class save. You know, appreciated probably even more by me because I was a keeper. Maybe people don't. Well, they might not have thought I was a keeper, but there you go. Anyway, you made a great save, and um, at two 0 I just said to the guys, "Listen, we'll keep it at this shape. We'll stay in the game, and then in the last 15, 20 minutes, we'll change it." And I told them before what we were going to do. And um, unfortunately, Lukaku does what Lukaku does. And when you play the big boys and they've got that extra little bit of quality, they took the game away from us, you know. And yet we still had a chance at the end. But we probably didn't hurt them enough second half, you know. And you probably saw where our frailties lay at that aspect. But again, I'm not one to stand here or sit here, sorry, and make excuses because. The lads gave me everything. They gave the club everything. I thought it was important that they showed some pride back, got some pride back, and I thought they showed the new manager some really encouraging signs. Okay. Any word on the fans? They were fantastic throughout the whole night. Yeah, they didn't sing my name though, did they? <laughs> <laughs> no, no, they were good. They, that, listen, the club's in a situation now where they've um, they've really got to stick together. They have to stick together now. They've got to go back to the bet 365. They've got to make it a fortress with the noise. They've got to get right behind the new manager. And um, listen, the good thing is, is that it's still very tight down there. I know our goal difference is horrific. And me being an ex-keeper, I'm not very happy about that. And I, I think one of the factors for that, and again, not trying to make excuses, but a huge factor in that is um, that we haven't been able to play the back same back three, back four, back five over a period of time. And it's cost us, to be honest, because here you want to be familiar with everything around you. You want to be familiar with the people in front of you. You gain relationships. And it's been difficult, especially difficult for Jack as a young goalie who's going to be, going to be up there with the best. But, um, yeah, and that's been been a problem so but I, as I said to you it really needs the club to pull together now it's been too much negativity too much and as an old manager said to me if they're all pulling the bell the same way then the bell will ring if they're not pulling the bell the same way it won't ring and then you've got a problem end of story